Hi Aquarius, this is Northern Light Tarot and this is your weekly general and love reading for the week of the 13th to the 19th of August 2018. Spirits, guides and the universe, please can I have general and love reading for Aquarius. Thank you very much. Okay then, let's get going with your reading Aquarius. Okay, so your signified card, the Hierophant. Wow, help or hinder the Wheel of Fortune. You've got two major arcanas here straight away. Wow. Okay. In your subconscious, the Three of Pentacles. In the recent past, the Hanged Man. External energy, Nine of Pentacles. Wow, this is turning into a beautiful reading for you this week. It really, really is. Uh, in your near future, the Six of Wands, in your feelings, the Queen of Cups, your environment, the Magician, oh, it's making so much sense, okay, uh, Hopes and Fears, uh, the Eight of Cups, and then the Outcome, which will need some clarification, we have the Five of Wands, okay, so this week, let me see, mm. Okay, Aquarius, you are being your, your, your strong characteristics are coming to the fore this week, okay, your strong independent mind, okay, um, I see you really using your amazing mind to take control this week, okay, uh, I feel as though uh, in the past, there's been some stagnation that things haven't been moving forwards the way that you've wanted them to okay i say that because we have the hangman in the recent past okay there's been a situation quite clearly that uh that that was causing you to not be able to move in the direction that you that you've wanted to go okay but that that's that, that cycle is now broken it's gone it's stopped okay because you are back on form i'm seeing that very 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 clearly okay and that is this this happens um and it can take you to amazing places this week okay so we've got the hierophant right there in the center as your signifier okay and then the help or hinder car the wheel of fortune if there's ever a week to take uh, to, to go with your strong independent thought process and to let it take you to wonderful heights this is the week to do it Aquarius okay most certainly okay the sky is the limit this week okay uh, in your external energy you've got like the nine of pentacles okay so you, you're going towards something and the, I'm feeling this week for you it's it's for those of you that it, it, it's something to do with your finances yeah there's been something that you've been waiting for okay and this is the external energy the nine of pentacles and then in the near future we've got the six of wands okay so for a, for a lot of you this week it's it's business focused work job finance business and the outcome is wonderful and it's all through your independent thought you taking control of your life path of you know of you where are you going you're going to do it this week okay you're going to do it and because you make the choice to say right this is it now this this is the path i decide and i am taking control that's when the wheel of fortune card comes in okay and that's when things just skyrocket okay they take such a wonderful turn okay with this six of wands okay whatever whatever you have had in the pipeline okay it's it's going in the right direction aquarius okay most certainly i feel as though for some of you that you know that you there's some collaboration going to need to go on here with with external people okay you need to make some connections okay um if this is to do with your business entrepreneurial sort of energies coming in here you need to connect with other people that is what is going to help this take off this week whatever it may be for you okay i say that because here you're aware of it it's in your subconscious 
you know that you need to to extend yourself get out there connect more to other people that's what you've got to do this week most certainly uh, uh, yeah yeah most certainly and um it could be something quite new as well and i feel as though you you know it, it's new uh, and you've never been down this path before and i don't feel as though that there's any trepidation on your part i don't feel as though you're worried about it i, I feel as though that the minute that you make the decision and you go ahead and you do it that's when everything just goes it skyrockets okay i say that because in your environment you've got the magician card okay so something is um is taken off taking flight this week most certainly um and your heart's in it as well it, it's dear to your heart aquarius okay whatever this may be and this is a weekly general and love reading so for some of you this is about another person and taking a leap of faith okay you're gonna take a leap of faith with somebody this week and if you do uh i feel that they, there's a strong earth energy out there so taurus capricorn virgo that you could be surrounded by that energy someone who's one of those star signs or uh, it's a rising sign or they have that energy of that they're practically minded they're stable they're balanced um somebody around you that that type of energy coming from that person watch out for them because they could offer you a lot relationship wise okay most certainly they could help balance your uh yeah you're, you're very strong and independent as are earth signs you know so that that together could be a force to be reckoned with okay i do feel as though um th there's some worry going into the future okay but it's you don't need to worry okay it's it's a uh, it's your in your hopes and fears zone we have the seven of cups okay so and then the outcome card is the five of wands so you know nothing ever comes nothing ever good comes i guess without some sort of level of uh stress and there could be some worry associated with it and even minor like tussles and arguments with other people and things like that i don't see that i don't see that this week has been significant however um i just feel as though there's some decisions you've got to make here and you're aware of it and you're worried about the decision that you do make could lead to um some arguments but i actually don't see it let me just uh get a clarifier card for this five of wands okay I think the guidance here is um, to be careful about the decision that you make this week. Take time, okay? Just take time on, on with your decision making this week, okay? Whether it be, um, you know, the, there's ways to sort of reach your goal and avoid... Uh, negative energies okay you have a very strong independent streak and not everybody has that quality and some people can be quite envious i guess of, of of your ability to to know what you want so i would just you know maybe if you do need to sugarcoat a decision this week do that to avoid avoid an argument okay uh, let me just get this clarified for this five of wands, please. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. <clears throat> okay, yeah. So, watch your words this week. I've got the Queen of Swords energy here. Okay. So, it's just telling me, yeah, to sugarcoat, to not be too, um, you know, gung-ho, to uh, straight in there with how you feel. You know, not everyone can take the truth. <laughs> not everyone can take it you know uh so whatever you do need to say this week make sure that you say it nicely that's all it's saying to me so it's nothing major um so yeah as i said it's you know we, we've got you know the wheel of fortune here it's a wonderful card we've got the magician you know in your environment and you it, it, 
it just doesn't get and in your near future this is the victory card as they call it okay so something is going your way this week whether it be relationship wise business wise um but it's about you using your strong independent mind this week okay aquarius i hope that you've enjoyed this reading i will be doing um a soulmate reading for the month of august uh for aquarius and all the other signs so if you check back with my channel soon probably in the next couple of days that will be there for you if you'd like this video i'd be so grateful if you could click the like button and uh, if you could subscribe to my channel i'd be so grateful and if you comment i would love some feedback so comment and i will always reply and if you'd ever like a private reading my email address is northernlighttarot at gmail.com and that's in the description box below okay so i hope you've enjoyed this Aquarius, have a wonderful, fantastic week and I will catch up with you soon. Bye for now.